All right. That J and J or J and J means the seafood. Let's get it. Today we got J and J wings and seafood, and I gotta tell you guys, <laughs> I'm really excited. A lot of people in the comments were talking about J and J wings and seafood, and I need to try it out. Uh, they just do the salt and pepper wings over there, uh, which is fine by me. Awesome, um, I love me some salt and pepper wings, um, or as we say down here in the South, some wings. I don't know what y'all say wherever you are. But down here, we say wangs. So get it get it straight. Um, yeah, but I'm going to tell y'all, though. <laughs> I was speeding to get home on my lunch break. I was speeding to get home. And I'm so glad that the police do not really monitor those highways. Because, uh, yeah, I would have got pulled over riding dirty. With these white bricks. I know what I'm talking about. These white bricks. Yeah. You got a big white brick like that. You know it's supposed to be something good, right? Alright, let's check it out. Let's take a look at these. So here we go. Got the white brick. It's like they did some for ventilation. Let the steam get out of there. Alright. Ooh. Salt and pepper wings. Ooh, those fries look good. I, I can't wait to get into those fries, too. Okay. Now, no offense, J&J, &J, but, you know, it looks beautiful. But I'm going to go ahead and do what I do, you know. <laughs> we don't do the green round here. No, sir. Uh, nothing against the prep, though. It looks beautiful. Got to put a little garnish because, I mean... If it just looked like this, you know, it's appealing. It's appetizing because it's wings. But not everybody is like me. They need to see some garnish, you know, something something beautiful. Um, all right, now we've got that removed. We're going to go ahead and try this out. Let me let me see. I did, with Mama Kim's, I did, uh, well, okay, got some crispiness to it. All right. Good deal. Um Let's dig in. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. Okay. I'm going to tell y'all right now. Mmm. Mmm. And I just want y'all to know I'm not. If you hear me comparing some wings to somebody else's wings, I'm not, uh, I'm not, uh, Lord, I got some sinuses going, so... But uh, I'm I'm not uh, like comparing like who's better or anything like that. That's not that's not what these videos are all about. I haven't tried wings in the area since we moved down here. That's what this is about. I'm trying the wings. So uh, just let y'all know, this got some spice to it. Not too much, not too much, but spicier than Mama Kim's. Um, and I don't know if I mentioned on the Mama Kim's video, but I meant to say that, you know, a lot of people might not like uh, their wings like super spicy. And when you only offer one flavor or two flavors, whatever, um, and you don't have the different spice options, you got to play it careful. So I can totally, totally understand why Mama Kim's wasn't that spicy. And to be honest, I'm not like a huge spice person. You know, I got a little, little coon ass in me. So, you know, I don't mind the spice. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll do spicy. I'll do some straight up hot, hot buffalo wings, you know, whizangs. But, uh, but this right here, this right here is a little spicier than Mama Kim's. And once again, I'm not hating. It's, it's good. All right. We'll get with a little ranch going on. Yeah. I'm going to grab a new one for the video. You know, that's not normal. Usually, I, I'm i just going to take the whole wing down to the bone when I eat me some wings. 
Okay. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. Mmm. These are good, y'all. These are good, y'all. I'm going to tell you right now, if you're down on anywhere near Twin City or Blue Bonnet, <coughs> they got two locations. They got one Blue Bonnet, one Twin City. I'm going to tell you right now, if you haven't had some J&J &J wings and seafood, you're missing out. Because, I mean, I put wings in front of seafood, so they're touting their wings now. To me, like, we don't really have, like, a wings place around here. Except, I guess, wing junkies or whatever. Like, this over, I got to try them soon over in Orange. But, but I mean, is it Bridge City or Orange? I think it's Orange. But, anyway. Yeah, but, uh, but man, so, if y'all haven't tried this out, I know I'm, I'm a latecomer. I know. I know. That's okay. Some of y'all probably haven't tried this yet. Mm. Now, let me tell y'all something else I noticed over there at J&J &J Wings and Seafood. They've got a practically like half a convenience store over there of drinks. Sorry, drinks. So we say wings, okay? And then we say drinks. And let me tell you what I'm talking about. Some drink. Yes, I went ahead and got me a jug. Um, I know you can get this at Walmart, Walgreens, wherever. But H-E-B, whatever. You can get H-E-B, yeah. But look, it was out of convenience. I paid a little bit more for it. So what? This is my favorite tea. This is my favorite thing to grab at the convenience store. So I was excited when I saw it, okay? We got some red drink, people. Uh, let me pour it up. Here, I need a little drink because it's got a little spice. Now, you can't settle down in there, kids. No, no, no. Dad, I'm going to pause. I'll be right back. All right. Well, I think y'all know what that was. That was the sound of an uh-oh, a mistake. Yes, I got two children that are homesick today, unfortunately. But uh, one of them had spelt, spilled a drink. So, right as I was talking about drink, she done spilt hers. So, it was an emergency that had to be addressed right then. I don't know if I can do this video stuff, people. I don't know, y'all. This, this might be too much. <laughs> uh, this might be a good time to let everybody know I got five of them. I got I got kids like I got wings. I got five kids, so it ain't nothing for two of them to happen to be home from school sick. But anyway, it's what happens. It's, it's the life I live, you know. We spill drink all the time over here. We love to spill some drink. Yeah. Anyway, uh, let's check out this drink that I was about to pull up, though. So as I was saying, we got the red drink. Yeah, now, I don't know if we're the only family that uses mason jars or giant measuring uh, Pyrex uh, measuring cups to drink out of, but this one has a handle on it. It's a little fancy, you know, but uh, we have just some straight up mason, mason jars we drink out of sometimes. Anyway. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. That's so good. Thank you, J&J &J Wings and Seafood, for that Arizona watermelon. Goes nicely. Pairs nicely with your wings. Mm, let's get these fries. I think we got like the... Mm. Mm-hmm. Similar season to the wings on them. Mm. That's good right there, y'all. Mm. 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 Mm -hmm. yeah, man. Twin City, man. That's not that bad of a drive for for me. Be hitting y'all up in the future. Mm. Need to try the rest of y'all's menu out. Y'all seafood. This started as a wings adventure, but 
Yep. I'm gonna have to try it all out. Mm. Well, thank you so much, everybody, for recommending this one to me. Um, I loved it. Thank you. I'm glad we got wings in the area, y'all. Whew, I was about to I was about to start tripping. But we got some wings.